how is Cora, Cora OBD doing? You know, I know a lot of people like her, a lot of people don't like her, a lot of people see her as a responsible lady, a lot of people don't see her as a responsible lady. You know, at times in life, we have to support people um, just the way they are, you know, encourage them and Maybe at times you should tell them the truth. You know, it's not the truth. The fact that you don't like something, it doesn't mean that it's the right thing. It might be. It might be. You know, you expect people to do things the way you want it. At times it's not like that. Okay. So the reason why I said, how is Cora OBD doing? It's a lot of people will break down after something like this happened why a lot of people will still like moving for move forward you know and if you look at this color obd i have like i really admire her a lot all right i know good and bad things has happened to her since all this while but if you see you see that the good part the good things that has happened to her is more than the bad things and which is normal even if you are with your husband or you are not with your husband it happens but a lot of people are judging her that most things are happening to her because she left her husband. Order because her husband left her. Okay. But that is not the truth. Even if you're with your husband, things can happen. Alright. You're with your husband, you're not with your husband. It doesn't mean stop anything from happening to you. But what I really admire about this lady is her encouragement, her focus, and you know she just she is growing she is progressing she didn't allow these things to weigh her down the way people insult her the way people give her bad comments at times i know people also do support her but no matter what she didn't allow any of these things to weigh her down that is the most important part of this whole thing you know what i'm trying to say is that's why i ask how is Cora obd doing a lot of women we should learn from her you know, like in everybody's story, there there must be something you want to learn from. There must be something you want to trash. You know, this thing I don't like it. Let me just trash this, okay? But what thing I admire about her is she didn't bring herself down. She didn't um like ah do this. You know this self pitying that some people will be doing. Ah. My husband is no longer here. I wish my husband would see it. You know, a lot of women, they are down today. Like, they refuse to rise when their husband leaves them. That's because you don't know your value. You know, this lady, she knows her value. She knows it. And she is working towards it. If you see, you see the award she, she carried. You, you see how she is progressing in a movie industry. In a, uh, sorry, in a music industry. You know, in a movie, music career, sorry, in a music career, she is going well, and her kids are fine. Her kids are okay. She think of her kids very well. You know, she's not just a mother. She's also a friend, a sister, and she have a lot of fans that also love and 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 admire her. Okay, so what I'm trying to say is, we women, we should try and put some value on ourselves. We should try and see the importance of you that name woman or lady try and be creative try and help yourself try and grow try and learn how to stand on yourself by yourself on your own without anybody supporting you by the time you learn how to do all these things you will see that you really don't need the man to grow yes man comes together Man and woman will come together and we plan together. You know, by the time you have something up there, and the man have something up there, you guys will will just be you guys will just click and be moving. But as a woman, you should learn how to stand on your own in case it happened that nobody pray for a broken home, but no. But if it happened that the thing is not working the way you you imagine it or you program it to be you know because no one is perfect so in case it's not working the way you wanted it to be 
then you can know that okay now i can take care of myself you know with or without my husband or with or without my partner so look at this cora obede now just look at take a look at her is she not doing well for herself she is doing well she is a millionaire like millionaire with or without her husband she's still going well I know a lot of people don't, don't like her lifestyle. Come on, guys. She is a singer and a dancer. Look, look, let's take a look at Rihanna. Take a look at Beyonce, for example. Do you see her dance what they wear? Is it because she's a Nigerian? It doesn't matter where you come from. What matter is the career, your career determine how you dress at times. Yes. A musician. You know, we all know the way they dress. You see, when, when Rihanna was pregnant, you see the way she was dressing. You could see her belly, you see her everything. So, what is so different about her? Why people just keep criticizing this lady because of her lifestyle? It's, it doesn't really make sense though, you know. And another amazing thing I love about this lady is she never allowed people talk to weigh her down. To bring her down and another ama amazing thing i like about cora obidi is 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 as she know how to put a lot of people in where they belong like put them where they where they belong what do i mean by this at times when some people talk to her anyhow or they corrected her the way she don't want she give them what they want you know because if you don't want insults you shouldn't try to correct adults she's a mother of two that means she's not a child all right so whatever she's doing she know what she's doing and i think she's okay with it so if you can't support her that means you're against her so maybe that's why she's doing what she's doing so a lot of women need to learn that as a lady you should know how to take care of yourself before your husband or wherever your partner can contribute to your life don't rely on anyone. Woman should not rely on their husband and husband should not rely on their wives. It's like that. We will know how to put ourselves where we belong. There will be respect and as a like distance, respect and also everybody will be happy. So guys, just watch Kora Obede and see how we are in the semi-finals for the opening act competition. Sorry, I look like an Animbeke this morning. I look like Animbeke, but we are in the semi-finals. Semi-finals for the opening act competition. You guys know that I have been competing to be one of the artists that get to perform at the Hollywood Bowl in Los Angeles, California. It's going to be a big win for us, either way. It's going to be a big win. So, are you... Are you what what are you waiting for please go straight to this link and vote for me i am in second place we cannot afford to be in second place so please just do off me a favor right now right now right now right now go to the link and vote for me please i am pleading good morning and welcome to my live my name is coral Beatty. Singing Dancing Princess all the way from the motherland. Don't forget to take good care of yourself. Good morning. Thank you, Afisa Springer. Achieve Churindre. Thank you so much. Appreciate you. Where are the babies? They are with your daddy. And... I'm gonna get them on Sunday, okay? So guys, don't worry, I've not lost custody of my kids. For all of you who are worried, no, it's just a new arrangement, okay? I love you. Um, yeah. I am in second place, but you know we cannot be in second place. So, you see that link over there? Go and click on it. Make sure you get your daily vote. There's a free vote. You scroll all the way down. You don't need to pay anything. Get your free vote. We cannot be in second place, guys. Please. Please. We cannot be in second place. I don't want to come here and be all anxiety reading and like, oh, oh. No. 
but we're in second place. We can't really be in second place. You want jiggets, jiggets, jiggets. We have to be. We have to be in first place. Why is it that anytime I wear this dress, it does that? Crazy. <sighs> oh my god. Oh my god. We made it to the semi-finals of the opening act competition where I'm going to do you don't do skeleton skeleton. Hey, I bo ish. Either do your body skeleton dun dun ay. Eh? Kenke, either do kele boom kele boom kele boom kele. On you va? Let's go. I'm going to perform on the... If we get this, guys, it's such a huge win for us. It's such a huge win. I can't even explain how much of a huge win it is. You know? Thank you. Love you. Faye, how do you feel this morning? You okay? Faye, you good? I prayed for you yesterday. I hope you feel better, queen. I hope you feel better. The other day, someone said there are 16 people in first place. Jesus. Ah. Uh, hey. Yeah, what? You don't be scaring me like that. Like, I don't like to be scared. You know, like, I just want to be in a happy place. Like, I'm not trying to be that. You said what? The other day, someone said there are 16 people in first place. I'm wondering if they meant competing for first place. Eh, 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 please don't be wondering here because but you're you wondering <laughs> you're giving me anxiety <laughs> oh my god i don't like it i don't like it please just go and click the link and vote because i'm I, don't give me anxiety okay like i don't want it i don't want it i don't want it what should i do to my head today what should i do yeah like uh, it said you're in first place this morning i woke up i saw second place i don't know maybe but yeah their algorithm is playing with my emotions they're trying to make me they're trying to make me you know Faye, thank you so much for 1000 stars i love you queen i literally smile and beam up with happiness when i see you and i hope that you feel better today i love you still feeling a little pain but i'm okay okay